it's staged for Netflix. Harry throws tantrum at Meghan for out-of-place demand at polo match. Meghan Markle was pictured kissing her husband Prince Harry after his polo team won a tournament in California, and according to a body language expert one of Meghan seemed to have an air of caution about her. Meghan Markle was quick to congratulate Prince Harry on his latest polo tournament win. She was pictured giving her husband a kiss on the lips after his team were victorious in the Lyle Nixon Memorial Trophy at Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club in California. Meghan, who wore a black polka dot blouse and white shorts, presented the prize to the team and kissed the members on the cheek. When it came to Harry, she planted a kiss on his lips. Some of her red lipstick rubbed off, and Meghan quickly gave Harry's lips a wipe to take a stain off. According to body language expert Judy James, despite it being a sweet gesture by Meghan, it looked totally out of place among Harry's macho teammates. And she also told the mirror that during the kiss, Meghan seems somewhat restrained, although it's for an obvious reason. She explained, Meghan is in complete command, control and steer mood with this congratulatory kiss at polo. Previously the couple's signature hand clasp with meshed fingers and Harry's glances of appreciation and Meghan's smile responses showed their usual high levels of affection and, of course, polo is the traditional peacocking sport for royal males who get to show off their dashing bravado in the saddle as well as their muscles in those romantic white jodhpurs, but for the winner's kiss here there was still a level of caution from Meghan. As Harry leans in with all his customary keenness for some intimacy signaling, Meghan places two hands up to his face in what looks like a bit of a steering and restraining gesture. The reason why looks pretty obvious. Meghan's wide-brimmed hat, giant shades and red lipstick would all form a tactical nightmare for anything more passionate than a peck on the cheek. Even with this carefully planted cheek kiss, it appears Meghan needs to check her hat and her shades afterwards, laughing as she shares the moment with her husband. Even with all her carefulness though she is still left wiping lipstick off Harry's face afterwards in a very sweet gesture that nevertheless looks rather out of place in the rather macho infused lineup of Harry's team of polo players. Royal fans have slammed Harry and Meghan's passionate kisses staged and for the cameras on stage. Some royal fans have reacted poorly to the exchange, however, with many claiming the Sussexes are playing up to the cameras following reports they'll be releasing a Netflix documentary this year. One disgruntled fan wrote, Does anyone else think it is all false? Don't they say if you have to say it or show it all the time it's not genuine? Why does she have to keep pawing him all the time? By the way that was an actress kiss for the cameras. The picture of her dragging him away from his teammates is very telling. Another rudely asked, anyone here the Netflix producer yell cut when that woman kissed Harry? She'll be slobbering all over him when she knows the cameras are on her when she comes over for the Jubilee, wrote a third. The charity match was organized by the Sussexes and was dedicated to raising money for several local charities, including Food Bank Santa Barbara County, C4LM4 Kids and Heal the Ocean. Some royal fans pocked fun at the fact Harry got a trophy at an event he organized himself. One fan wrote, I find it funny that they organized this polo game and she gave Harry a trophy, they also organized something a few weeks ago and presented themselves with a trophy, I think I will present myself with a silver cup later. The Sussexes' kiss on the podium was similar to the one shared by Princess Diana and Prince Charles in 1985.